We have people writing questions live as the show unfolds. We have Maggie and Emmy. They're intelligent, they're lovely, and they're here to make our four contestants' lives difficult. Tell us a little bit about what you do on the show. Uh, so, we write questions live about what's just happened on the show. But we want to throw some facts and figures in, things that are totally irrelevant, that they might pick up on and think is going to be a question. OK. Emmy and Maggie will be setting memory questions until the final round. But first, we need to get some money in the bank for you, so we're going to play our first moneymaker round. Change the lights. <laughs> right, Cara. Now, I'm a dreamboat. Everyone knows that. So I'm going to give you the answers. The Sun, The Guardian, Daily Mail. Is the oldest. Oh, The Guardian. It Woo! is The Guardian. Yeah! Supported fascism in the 1930s. The sun. Wrong answer. Oh! Fudge six. Fudge six. Fudge six. Because your children were watching. Exactly. OK, next question. Had the headline, Freddie Starr ate my hamster. The Daily Mail. It's the sun. Uh -huh. So a woman went to the newspaper and said that Freddie Starr asked for a sandwich. When she refused to get him one, he grabbed her hamster, slapped it between two pieces of bread and ate it. And <laughs> Freddie Starr was a bit upset at the time because he's a vegetarian. According to Dr Maggie, which rodent-eating star was actually a vegetarian? I know the whole story. <laughs> Except... <laughs> <laughs> I know he had a sandwich, I know he put a hamster in it, I know he walked into the shop what he ordered, <laughs> I know everything else. <laughs> um, what answer could I say that I don't look like an idiot? Mars. <laughs> Mars. <laughs> Which road meeting star? And you'll go with Mars. Yeah. <laughs> Which is a planet, not a star. Yeah. It's... <laughs> It's an epically stupid answer. <laughs> if you didn't want to look like an Egypt, you've played this horrifically badly. If you did want to look like an Egypt, nailed it! <laughs> Guessing a human would have been... You had seven billion to choose from, and you chose a celestial body called Mars. <laughs> Is it the right answer? Like, oh, I tell you, if it's Venus, you're going to pick yourself, aren't you? <laughs> Freddy star. It was up there. Which star? <laughs> Could have put that in the title and I wouldn't have got it. <laughs> OK, so if you are guessing a thing, sometimes it's good to guess in the area. <laughs> Make it good, please. Make it nice. Be nice. What kind of a boat did I vainly and inaccurately describe myself as? <laughs> I'm going to let this go, cos I'm a good guy. <laughs> but after the show, it's going to be hell to pay. What kind of a boat did I vainly and inaccurately describe myself as? Uh, jet ski. <laughs> <laughs> it's a boat. If you think at some point this evening, I went, I'm a jet ski. <laughs> I'm a fuck. Hey, Emmy, Maggie, I'm a jet ski. <laughs> what kind of face is that? What kind of a guy? Gives you all the answers to the questions. What kind of guy literally tells you the answers to every question before they even ask the question? What kind of a guy? A dreamboat does that. <laughs> dreamboat. Not a fucking jet ski. <laughs> Should we have a look and see if jet ski's up there? <laughs> I'll tell you what, it isn't. Uh, dreamboat. I'm a goddamn dreamboat, close. damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Jimmy Carr, the guy you just saw in that video. Thanks for watching it, because uh, somehow I get money from that. I, I don't know how. I don't, I don't know. P probably, probably it filters through some sort of advert that you watched before you watched the video, maybe? Or maybe you subscribed? Anyway, thanks for watching it, and somehow that benefits me. And hopefully I'll see you at a live show at some point further down the sunny road. Good luck.